What's going on everyone? This is Ellip and I decide to show you guys what I've been working on. I'm working on some samples actually, some loops actually from Studio One 3. Going over here into my loop section and just playing around with some of the loops. This is what I came up with so far. I haven't add anything of my own yet just grabbing some of these loops here some of these samples place in here and kind of chop things up so this is the first one I pulled just add that in here the four bar loop here and I, I grabbed this this kick here lightweight kick and just chopped it and just duplicated it and then for this section that's my hat right there and then more of a harder kick here yeah let's create a ranger here and when I double click I've always been thinking that it's gonna allow me to rewrite something, but I got to remind myself to to right click and then double double click there to relabel it. Call it beat or whatever. Give another color. Cool. So what I'm gonna do here is actually do that all right so we're gonna grab our, our loop here and do our thing here Turn that down. Bring that in. I haven't learned how to this is considered step uh recording i'm always so used to just input putting it in and not really paying attention to where they go on the on the grid i was listening to a clap that i thought was pretty good Think that'll work so we're gonna put that there we're gonna actually put that bring that back some trim that a little bit and then bring it over manually like that and then select them both then duplicate bam so now I can just add a baseline in here if I want or if I find something that's suitable for what I'm trying to do here that'll definitely work but and what I also did was I add a reverb for my this percussion sound or whatever whatever it is and I can do the same for the others. I can use a slight reverb.
Let's add a baseline in there. Let's go with the FM8. Something like that. Let's change that one note. Alright, and I can also change this to be waves as well in case I wanted to just keep everything, you know, working with waves. Let's bring in, I don't know, something else like a, like a melody, a melody or something. So, we're going to bring that in on the next section. We're going to pull this back some here. And bring in this loop right here. I'm just gonna continue with the FM and see if I could find something. cool so i think i did i did i did uh fairly well i'm satisfied with what i did and the whole goal is to get this let's see so i'm looking well i need probably like another minute so i'm trying to complete this for something and you know i just decided to show you guys what i came up with never really work with samples like this on this level but this came out pretty good <laughs> i just added a few of my touches with the you know with the um the lead and then the the bass line and then everything else was purely samples which is awesome you know what makes the song is the melody so i created my own melody and that's what pretty much makes the song so remember music is art you're the artist, paint your picture.